Hello and welcome to this Dr. Rossmas key skill video on drawing a cumulative frequency graph given a cumulative frequency table. Now what does the word cumulative mean? The word cumulative just means running total. So we've got recordings of lengths of 50 animals and the lengths are here and cumulative means running total so it means the total number of things up to up to a particular value. So that's the key magic words up to. So we have three things up to a length of 40, between 35 and 40. And then we have eight animals with a value of up to 45 centimetres, because it's from the starting length of 35 all the way up to our current value we're considering of 35. And then we've got 24 animals up to a value of 50 centimetres, 32 animals up to a value of 55, etc. So it's quite easy to plot these now. We just use the value on the right of each range, the value we're going up to, the length we're going up to, with the cumulative frequency. So we've got three animals with a length of up to 40. So we do 40 and then go up to a cumulative frequency of three, which is roughly here. And we also need to have a starting point. So what length do we know we have no animals of a length up to? Well, we have no animals with a length of up to 35 because we know the length of all the animals is at least 35 centimetres. So therefore, at 35 centimetres, we know there's zero animals with a length of up to that. So this value on the left, we need an extra point where we plot that with a cumulative frequency of zero because there's no animals with a length of up to 35. Now let's plot the rest. We've got eight animals with a length of up to 45. So 45, eight, which is roughly there. And then 24 animals with a length of up to 50, so we're going up to here. Then 32 animals with a length of up to 55, which is about here. And then 39 animals with a length of up to 60, so 60, 39. And then finally, 50 animals with a length of up to 65, so 65 is here, 50. And then all we do is we can join these up either using straight lines between each pair of dots or we can actually join it up with a smooth curve. Now I'm just going to do straight lines between each of them but a curve will also be fine and that will be our completed cumulative frequency graph. They usually start at this corner here but that would only be if this length on the left, the value is consistent with the starting value, but it's not. This length here is 30 centimetres, where we're actually starting from a length of 35 centimetres.